okay so let me just briefly tell you the failure of free electron gas theory basically it was it got failed because of the oversimplified approximation of the potential experienced by the electron inside a crystal it was considered to be constant or zero potential now the actual scenario inside a crystal is different here the actual form of the potential is really very complicated but scientist tried to explain it by taking a periodic potential okay periodic potential with a period of equal to the lattice constant a so this is an approximation of a one dimensional array of atoms and you can see the potential created because of that one dimensional array of atoms is shown like this in the previous uh, video i have drawn it like this and you see effectively this will take the form like this and this extra thing shows that it is near the surface this is the potential near the surface like if you consider uh, like this is the crystal if you consider like it is inside of the uh, matter so this will be the surface okay so this portion shows this area surface okay now still this form of the potential it is still very complicated so what we can do we can further approximate it we can further approximate it uh, you can draw a different picture for this so you can consider it like this this instead of this we can further approximate the potential like this why we need to approximate this because handling this type of potential is quite is not is not an easy task that is why we need some approximation so this is one approximation we have done but you see still this is complicated so we need further modification and that further modification can be done in this way like instead of this non linear type of thing if we just take a square type of potential then you know how to solve this kind of square type of potential my picture is not coming good this should be equal we'll do it in the next section now you can see this is a potential of square type now we can also shift the origin if we shift the origin then we can get uh, uh, you can get an approximate potential square well potential like this and this approximation of the lattice potential by some periodic square well potential form the basis of band theory of solids and you know what this design we have just like uh, you can say this is we have just shift the origin we have just shift the origin this portion has come to this side and you got this one this is a square uh, well potential and you can see it has some uh, width let's say this is minus b this is zero this is a so this is the lattice constant you have taken a okay so here uh, you can see the period is a plus b and this potential was taken in chronic penny model okay so this type of square well potential is described in chronic penny model and you can easily express this potential okay how can i put it express this potential we can write it the way you have done it in your quantum mechanics okay so let me just write it for you and one uh, other line i would like to uh, write here what should i write okay we are not going to need this for the time being so i am just omitting this and you should write a line this line is important like how we gonna be taking this thing in chronic penny model so you just write this line the potential energy the potential energy of an electron this line is very important the potential energy of an electron a plus b this is the potential you have taken 
and you can here you can see the period is a plus b the a plus b it is repeating so the period is a plus b i hope you understand the potential energy of an electron in a linear array of positive nuclei so we have considered this this is the positive ion core and one electron approximation we have taken so one electron is associated to each ion like this and for that we have drawn this simplified very simplified periodic potential the only problem with free electron uh, gas theory was it considered constant or zero potential but here we have taken the periodic potential now we will see how this potential lead us to the concept of bands in semiconductors and in insulators okay An academy is India's largest online teaching learning platform. You can prepare for various competitive exams like CSR, NET, GET, JEST, IIT JAM, TFR. Especially if you are preparing for CSR, NET, Physical Science, you can join me on an academy plus. I cover all the nine units of CSR, NET, Physical Science syllabus. My approach is especially I precisely give you the concept of the concerned topic. Then I discuss the relevant mathematical formula and do the analysis. Relevant problem based on the topic, including previous year questions, are discussed. Homework and assignments are also given. This is my profile and if you want to join my Anacademy Plus process, you can enroll for this course. And if you are new to this Anacademy uh, platform, you can take Anacademy Plus subscription using our referral code FelixR and Anacademy will give you 10% off. So take the Anacademy Plus subscription today and put your feet one step ahead towards reaching your goal. Thank you.